Hey, here's something free that I'm surprised nobody mentioned. Have you played yet with Gboard, Google's yeah. new yes. keyboard for iOS? Yes. Really It's great. like use no other. It's just done, yeah. right? Yeah, ju just the ability to search for things within <laughs> the keyboard uh, is just to, to access to search. Like So many times I have to flip between apps because I need to grab that thing or grab that picture or grab that URL as opposed to, oh, I, I'm guessing the the, the, key, the keyboard instead says, I'm guessing you were looking for this. Oh, yeah. thank you. Thank you, Google. Keyboard. The yes, only sir. negative, and a number of people pointed this out, is there's no uh, voice dictation button as there is on Android. And that's, I think, probably an Apple thing. Like, Apple wants to make sure you use the home button to launch Siri. Well, also, I mean, like, the keyboards are an extension, so they have very minimal resources available right. to them, which is why they have to let... Some people get freaked out that it says, you know, hit the share button, and they think, oh, all my stuff is going to Google. No, that just lets... And I wish Apple would clarify this and make that button more apparent. But that also just means that the app can go... Like, the keyboard can go back to the app and pull more information than... And the right. extension itself could contain. Right. So that's what's kind of cool. If you have the Google keyboard, uh, as I do on my Apple Notes program, uh, it looks like a regular keyboard. It's got autocorrect. Um, it has some, you don't have to have a separate emoji uh, keyboard. It also has uh, animated GIFs, and it will base those on the content uh, in your note. You can also tap that G thing, and it will look uh, for stuff to match, and you could do a yeah. search. Uh, and it includes not only the standard Google text search, but by the way, without leaving your note program yep. or whatever, but also image search and animated GIF search. So if you if you just, you know, you're saying, I need more animated GIF kitties, I just can now, I could put that in there and then you, you paste it in. And you, the most and interesting thing about this is Apple spent years trying to disintermediate Google from iOS. Like if you search, <laughs> you'll get iBooks recommendations. If you search, you'll like you could switch away from it. it you, it'll go through Siri. They'll do everything they can to stop queries going directly to Google. And then by making one fantastic keyboard, suddenly everyone is sending everything back to Google again. And I love that because you're competing off quality. You're not competing off yeah. any market lock-in. And yeah. there are lots of settings. I mean, if you're one of those people who wants all uppercase keys, you know the old style app. You can you you can do that. There's a ton of settings in here. It's a. I think I think the, it is has the same problem all third party keyboards have on iOS, which is Apple takes it back when, even if yeah. you delete the Apple keyboard when you're entering a password, things like that. But um, it, you know, this is this this is such a nice keyboard. I, I just as good I, as you can as you can. I do think it with it's as good. IOS. You you guys agree? Yeah. 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 Absolutely. Yeah. I was really it, pleased. It, 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 it really does. There, there are some places where you want simplicity, and then there's some place where the culture of choice will just always make a better product. And keyboards are right there. I, I, I really, think, I really think one of the reasons why iPhones and iPads have gotten so much better in the past couple of years is just simply that if you don't like X, you have the option of replacing X with Y, not system wide, but at least the important places like the keyboard. And this is, it just goes to show you that. This is not the sort of thing that you would think of unless you are a search-based company that's used not not just based on search, but is also uh, has been spending years with online apps that let the manufacturer observe how people are working with information to see that well, actually, people usually do it this way. So why don't we make it easy for people to do it this way? Yeah, glide or swipe <laughs> typing is built in. Yeah. Emoji suggestions as you type it will if you want a happy face and type something happy, it'll know. Uh, auto correction, auto capitalization, character preview, that's the pop up. I do you, wish there was a toggle that would let you switch between Roboto and San Francisco because I'm one of those mm -hmm. people who notice the difference yep. in character. It is Roboto, isn't bottom. it? Yeah. 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 Uh, that just, doesn't my, mean my you can't type in San Francisco, but the keyboard is in Roboto. Yeah, it's just yeah. my brain sees two different fonts on the page and just keeps switching back and forth. So yeah. <laughs> not yeah. everyone cares. Yeah. That's because you're a designer. You see these yeah. things that we don't see. Uh, see, now, and now you've got me once again picking up my my actual like Google Nexus phone that runs Android and saying that no, the new keyboard is not, not available. available. I oh wait, wait, no, 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 it's there's no, there a new keyboard. Just, no, no, it, it was it was released it was released a while ago, like a, a couple of weeks ago, but app, but Google actually will just sort of say we will let the first fifty thousand people have it, uh -huh. and then the. It's it's one of the reasons why they don't have to do like a point oh 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 one update because they decided to release it slowly to see what happens if people start mutating <laughs> if right. we put this in the water supply but also, yes, I mean, no, like, it's fun. nice did you it's get nice it because i don't have it on my android i oh, guess you're I, I, again it just it was i just checked 
I've been checking and it just arrived today as a, as available. It's yeah, I did get an update, but it wasn't that Google important. technically doesn't have to make, like there's no pressure to make this for Android, but they have a huge reward in making it for iOS. Exactly. And back in the search exactly. pipeline. You're going to be using the Google keyboard. Them. Although yeah. I have to say Android, because they've had allowed third-party keyboards for so long, has a very rich ecosystem of, of third-party keyboards. Apple does now somewhat too. Not, uh, well, not, not only that, but just as a sidebar, uh, one of the problems that uh, of the of the Android ecosystem is that uh, a company like Samsung can reskin everything and make it look more like a right. Samsung phone than anything else. So by releasing basically everything that makes uh, the application launcher, the photo system, the the keyboard now, all kinds of stuff are now just separate apps you can download into your phone uh, no matter who makes it. So you can make every phone look like stock Android. And also it means that now if they want to, they, they don't have to push out a system update to update the keyboard they can just update an app so it's it's one there are a lot of reasons why android went from it sucks to okay it's good it's not as good as the iphone to oh they solved so many of the pain points that now i really feel like i have a free choice and uh this sort of thing is uh, is in there too uh i'm excited about a keyboard i'm an idiot i Good know gboard no it's you. awesome gboard not since my i got the apple 2e is like, oh my god i've got a sh i've got upper and lowercase characters yay, yay i'm excited about yay. typing